Welcome, welcome, welcome to Machuza Media Projects. Today you are with me, Ugiven Po Hasako. I'm an artist doing dramatic arts and dance. Uh, today I'm here to present to you my work titled Corrupted Soul. It is written and directed and also performed by me. And on the 1st and the 2nd of December, I'll be performing at the South African State Theatre a piece titled Amajuba. I hope that you enjoy this performance and don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the comment on this product, on this performance today. Thank you for watching. My mother used to tell me lots of stories from long ago. I learned a lot from her stories. She always taught me to be kind to people. My father told me to be brave. I wanted to be brave like him. I just wanted to be like him. <laughs> you know, I used to put ash on my hair to make it look grey like his. I loved my father so much. But then one night when I was nine years old, I had a commotion in the household. I found my mother in my mother's heart, lying on his back on the floor in the midst of what seemed like an endless fit of coughing. He was very ill with some type of lung disease. After a year, my father followed. I was 11 years old. I was just 11 years old. So I had to go and live with my uncle Umsega Yisakometa. He was very tall and dark in complexion. He hated me so much. I did not understand why he hated me that much. He treated me like a slave in his house. He tortured me each and every day. But one day, he came home drunk and I took that as an advantage. I asked him, Maramalume, why are you treating me like this? Why are you treating me like a slave? He came rushing to me. Yawanavan! Yawanavan! You know, each and every time when I look at you, I see your father, that cold blood murderer. Don't ever ask me that question again. Am I sure? I was so scared, shocked. I did not understand what he was talking about. Only to find out my father was the cause of my aunt's death. The late principal command. You know, sometimes in life, our parents are the reasons of what we become. Am I today? I'm in prison with this small glimpse of light having a vision of an outside life. Locked within this bars. But as time goes, I learned to be a man. I learned to fight like a soldier. And I met a friend in the book. He taught me to be a good man.